What's up, Met fans? Welcome back, Talking Mets and Rob. How's everybody doing? Before I get started about the Bauer news, don't forget, guys, if you enjoyed this video, don't forget to smash on that like button. And if you enjoy my content and all my other videos and videos to come, don't forget, guys, press that subscribe button so you can get all your notifications when I post my videos. All right, guys, so the Bauer news. So apparently, according to Bauer's agent, Rachel Luba, it is down to two teams, the New York Mets and the Los Angeles Dodgers. I truly believe the Mets are the favorites. The Mets basically only have the, the best deal out there. I don't even know if the Dodgers actually have an official deal. So I, I don't think that the Mets are really bidding against anybody. I think they're bidding against themselves. And I think the reason why Rachel put it out there, that it's down to two, is to probably drive the price up for the Mets. What is it? I don't know. I saw something on Twitter. I don't want to post it. I don't want to show you guys because I'm not sure how reliable the source is. But it was a MLB Network radio guy and serious uh, XM radio guy that said that the Mets signed Bauer for five years, $175 million. I'm not really sure that um, th that's a lot of money. <laughs> if you really think about it, I mean, it's just way too much money, guys. And it just doesn't make it. $35 million a year for five years. I don't know if the Mets were really going to go that far. I thought it would be like mostly four years if they really had to, but I think it's going to be on a three-year deal. And I think Rachel and Bauer are just trying to drive up the Mets price a little bit. And that's what I'm thinking. And I really don't think that the Dodgers are heavily involved as some people might think. But to show you, uh, Rachel Luba talked about, said that there's two teams left down the two. John Hamey said the Mets are engaged with Trevor Bauer. They expect to hear something one way or another. Should be uh, finalized. For whichever team, most likely the Mets, in 24 hours. And then from Andy Martino on SNY, he said the Mets are quite serious. And he's not clear about all the teams that are involved. Could the Angels still be involved? I don't think so. But it's possible with the whole Callaway situation up in the air. And then the Dodgers. I really don't think the Dodgers have an official offer. I think if it was up to Bauer, he wants to go to L.A. But at the end of the day, if the Mets are going to give you another year, three years, four years and a little bit more money he's going to come to the Mets there's been reports also that uh he's been looking for an apartment in Long Island City how credible is that to us who knows but at the end of the day Trevor Bauer could be a Met by tomorrow or by Saturday I predicted and I feel like it was very possible that Trevor Bauer would make his decision before the Super Bowl and it seems like that's going to happen. And the reason for that, he loves attention. We already know that, guys. I mean, we talked about it over and over again on my live feeds, on my videos, in the comments. We all talked about it. Bauer loves attention. And there is no way he is going to sign on Sunday, Super Bowl Sunday, and after the, after the Super Bowl. Because all the talk's going to be about uh, Tom Brady and Patrick Mahomes and the game throughout the whole week next week. So what's the best time to say, this is who I'm signing with either tonight, Thursday night or Friday sometime during the day, probably midday because all the news is going to be about that. He's going to be the center of attention. That's what Trevor DeBauer likes. It's clearly what uh, his agent likes, Rachel. They're on YouTube. They love social media. They're always on it. So at the end of the day, guys, Trevor Bauer is going to make his decision soon. I have a really good, I feel like it's 90% chance that the Mets are going to sign Bauer and he's going to make his decision soon before the Super Bowl. Guarantee that. All right, guys, I want to thank you for watching. And as always, let's go Mets.